When I was 23 and starting to law school, I really wanted to go into the ministry. I do think that there's an internal barometer of justice that is inherent in each person's heart. I have worked with Chief Justice Martin for right at about 30 years now. It's just been a joy to work with him uh, during our tenure together. I think it's been uh, so amazing, uh, such a blessing to be able to serve the people of North Carolina in several capacities. Justice Martin has a pretty impressive resume for public service in North Carolina and I appreciate the sacrifice and commitment uh, that he's made and his family have made. The impact of my father and mother, just amazing. Uh, they emphasized that hard work and integrity uh, always made a difference. The integrity that Regent represents certainly will speak volumes through and about Chief Justice Martin. A man that is not merely a jurist, but a man that cares about all of the people that he serves. He has a gift of making everyone appreciate that their views are important. Those folks leave knowing that they've been heard, they've been understood. Throughout my 26 years of judicial service, uh, what I've enjoyed most, other than my time with the courts, is my time at the law schools. And we want to inspire our students to have total integrity. You're so fortunate to have him come to Regent. He's going to bring a level of excellence to the school. He's going to bring a commitment to students. Regent integrates faith into curriculum. We say purpose-driven. Each of us really wants to uh, do God's will in our professional lives. But for Regent, it is a, a wonderful choice. If they have an opportunity to learn from his commitment to others and to public service, that would be a great benefit. He sees and understands the big picture as we seek justice. I think the overriding aspect of faith for those in public service, as Rick Warren said, it's not about us. So my hope is to continue to create purpose-driven and practice-ready lawyers to change this world for the better.